A concussion is a head injury. So when we use the word concussion, it implies that a head injury had occurred. So in Rowan's situation, she had a previous head injury. So this devastating what happened on a Wednesday, but the previous uh, Friday and Monday, she was involved in uh, some rugby um, uh, competitions that involved her hitting her head. And um, what, what I heard was that um, she didn't come forth and she didn't declare her symptoms. And um, so her brain may have been primed uh, for an, another injury to, uh, to have a more devastating effect. And that's what happened on Wednesday. And when she got um, hit, uh, the brain's reaction was more severe than it would have been. Uh, so our, the thoughts are that uh, the second impact had occurred, that the brain hadn't had time to rest from the previous injury that was primed. And then they started to swell in a very uncontrollable, malignant fashion. The whole point of um, education is to allow the players in addition to you know, teachers, coaches, and parents, to recognize that an injury has occurred and then take the, take the appropriate steps um, to, um, to rest. Um, and, and that's the only treatment available is to rest, not to re-engage in a sport too early. Because one of the devastating things that could happen, which is rare, is what you heard today was the second impact syndrome that Rowan had. But there's other conditions that occur, which uh, sometimes could be um, quite devastating, not to the point of somebody dying, but they could have symptoms that last much longer, uh, weeks to months to even years.